morning you guys so we are ready for the gym in the gym attire i'm just currently having oh the sun is blazing today although it's not as hot as it has been sorry i know i'm off camera i have not got my <laughs> tripod out but um yeah i just took silly for a nice walk this morning i'm having my shake what i do is i blend my oats and like mix it with like cold milk because oats are really good before gym because they're nice quick carbohydrate give you that energy make you feel full um but i just haven't been feeling like them like since it's been warm so i just blend them and make them into like a milkshake and i like them mm. Hi, I told you to go to the system on the back. Okay, I'll be calling you on take my hand out of you. Hey guys, so I just got back from to the supermarket and the gym oh my god i ended up going to a body conditioning class i always said to myself i wanted to try it and i thought let me just see if there's any spaces there's a lady that, that literally goes to like all of the classes like every single day she goes about four classes a day i don't know how she does it um and she's like looks like maybe about 10 years older than me <laughs> puts me to shame but um yeah so I ended up going to body conditioning and then I went to yoga. Body conditioning was good, but I just felt like I was too tired for yoga. So I just feel like next time I'm going to just do one class. Um, yeah, because before I used to go gym and then go yoga, but I just feel like, I don't know, maybe because there was a little bit of cardio <clears throat> in the body conditioning class. So I think I'm just going to either stick to the gym and then go yoga or just come straight to yoga because yeah i was way too tired and yeah it wasn't it just wasn't the one i didn't enjoy yoga as much and i didn't have my yoga mat and the yoga mats in my gym are absolutely disgusting i <laughs> i sprayed it and cleaned it twice but i just i didn't feel 100 percent relaxed but um yeah that's that yeah so i went to aldi's tilly is on heat and she's not herself i have to put like actual diapers on her nappies um because the doggy ones are like expensive and i'm gonna need like maybe like two three packs because she's usually on for like two weeks or i know it's like teen mine to some people um but yeah the doggy ones are just like so expensive and i just think you can get so much more nappies for a quarter like fraction of the price and i like to change make sure i'm changing them often because i don't want her to like get any infections or anything like that so yeah she doesn't like wearing them so she's been sulking refusing to come out of her crate like she'll run in her crate as soon as she sees the nappy come out so that has been fun but anyways let me show you what i got from aldi it's nothing really exciting and there's only a few bits really like i said tilly's been not herself she's been really off of her food so um i noticed on saturday i bought um I bought these, um, it's like an aromatic duck kit from Aldi. So you get the duck, you get the pancake, and you get the hoisin sauce, I think you get. Um, so you just have to buy like the other bits to go with it. So me and my friend was eating it and she was just literally like begging us for some. And I gave her a little bit and she really liked it. So because she hasn't been eating much, even her treat, she's been refusing guys. So I thought, let me get her one. Even though Aldi had put them up to six pounds something and they were like, four pounds something before i know it's like a couple of quid but trust me it, it makes a difference but anyways they got a bit squashed because i put them in my backpack this is what they look like it's the aromatic half crispy duck with hoisin sauce and pancakes it says it serves two but i eat one to myself and i'm not about to share mine i really was craving it again today because i had to share my, my, my friend when she came so <laughs> today i was like let me treat tilly to some um because she's on and you know just just to let like have something you know like us ladies when we're having our period as well it's just like we want what we want so i know she really liked these when we was eating them so i got her one obviously she won't have the pancakes 
or the hoisin sauce like i'll have that for myself i love i don't know if i'm saying it right but the hoisin sauce is oh delectable there you can you can buy like the hoisin sauce separately i've done that before so i can have extra sauce because one is just not enough for me what you get in the pack but it just does not taste the same so um literally i'm going to be taking her hoisin sauce i think she might be able to have pancakes because they're just made out of like flour so i might just like rip up a few of those in there for her so she can have that um yeah so this one is for tilly um i also got some eggs for myself because there was there was such a big restock on the eggs and i'll be so i thought let me pick some up and i eat eggs literally every day um also i bought some smoked pepper mackerel i know they say that these are like quite high in fat but fat it's not bad for you it's like carbohydrates that you need to watch um anyway everyone has their own allergy or like what is good for you what is bad for you so just just do you and i'm not i'm not really bothered guys as long as i'm eating healthy ish whatever working out i feel good like i'm healthy inside and out so yeah i don't really mind the weather is much better today guys it's not like that hot even though it's a little bit muggy and there's not much breeze but it's cloudy and it's not too sunny so i'm enjoying the weather a big cucumber i don't know why i got a big one i should have got a small one because i never finished the, these the big ones and i the other day i didn't know i was gonna have to share my duck with my friend and i got a small one because i thought i never eat the big ones let me get a small cucumber and then now today i'm having it to myself i got a big one but tilly can actually have cucumbers so i might actually give her a little bit on the side i've got these tortilla wraps i absolutely love these i just pop them in the freezer and then just take them out as i need them so that's that i've got some salt i know this one is not the best for you but you know like sometimes when you're cooking certain dishes like this salt dissolves much more easier than like crunchy um thick cut um sea salt so i do use it occasionally but i have like like proper kosher salt in the cupboard it's crazy like how you have to explain like explain yourself online because people just make comments but anyways i think that's it okay no also got some extra virgin olive oil because that's all i literally cook with um and i think i think that's it you guys saw me bought by those um these kind bars i always have like a bar when i'm going to like the gym i always have a bar um i'm not too bothered about like protein because i know i have protein after my carbs are before the before the gym so but i just thought let me have these i was buying the the trek bars but i just didn't feel like anything was too heavily chocolatey um so yeah i shall keep these i don't know if i should keep one in my bag no, i'll leave it out i won't be going to the gym tomorrow tomorrow's gonna be a rest day um no i want to go yoga tomorrow that's a lie there's a yoga class that i really want to go to tomorrow so i think i'm going to go yoga tomorrow then i won't go gym wednesday um maybe not thursday i don't know i'll work it out <laughs> i just don't like to overdo it now because i get too tired and i can't get other stuff done but yeah that's my little haul so far so guys i've just got done filming guys look at this last dress i feel like i show you <laughs> a dress or some type of new piece of clothing every single vlog but yeah look at this dress i think it's so cute i just did a boohoo plus size try on haul if you want to see the rest of the haul go check out my plus size fashion channel at crown precious xo i've probably said it a million times but yeah i really like this one i need to get out of this makeup quick dinner um look after my dog yeah guys hey guys i'm currently having some post coffee excuse the setup i'm having a panini bacon and cheese bacon and chutney i think it is and an iced caramel latte mm. I've not got a tripod with me, so let's just try to balance it on. Sorry, this is a flat an angle, isn't it? 
It's my first time actually trying this, a bon appetit. I think it's a type of cheese. No, it tastes very cheesy. Mm. I was gonna get a Greg's breakfast, but I think it's too heavy before yoga. I'm going to yoga. I didn't say that. <laughs> I'm going to yoga. I really needed this. I felt so sleepy. <clears throat> but yeah, I'm gonna enjoy the rest of this, guys. So I thought we could make some lunch together. Well, it's like nearly dinner time because it's like half three. Oh, I got so annoyed earlier on. Um, you know when someone just annoys you and then I just come for eight? I just had like a massive bowl of, what's these things called? Multi-grain ho hoops, like Cheerios. I had a massive bowl of Cheerios and I had um, like about 10 crackers with jam. So yeah, that was my comfort lunch type breakfast thing. I ate quite good in the morning, like I had um, had my coffee and I had my porridge and stuff. <sighs> Anyhow, I'm feeling a little bit more calm now. I swear guys, I'm a person that just eats their emotions. This lighting, I don't think it's the best, but I don't know where my tripod is. And yeah, I wasn't about to start looking for it. So you guys are just gonna have to bear with my, my summy. <laughs> Okay, so these are, let me show you. These are my potatoes. I just roasted them in the oven. They just got some olive oil on them and I just pricked them so that they could cook evenly. Okay, stay, please stay. Okay, so I think I'm gonna do those four, five, six, seven. I don't even know why I did seven. Oh, hot potato. These are gonna be so good. You guys cannot even see. Okay, that's better. It's just a shame I'm not using a plate. If you guys want to see them better, but I'll show you afterwards. Oh, that potato looks so nice, you guys. Do one. And I'm gonna do two. Um, I did like two now. If I did three, then there's four left for tomorrow. I don't know why I did seven. And like, it's just weird. I did three. Probably not gonna feel hungry for dinner. three whole potatoes like that. Such a shame I cannot be bothered to go and find oh to go and find my my tripod. Actually let me put you over here. It might be better. So here they are. I'm just gonna do this one handed. I need to locate my tripod but oh did you guys just see that? That looks so satisfying right that's one. I feel like the exposure is too high on this. Hold on. I got a tin of these baked beans, like no added salt or sugar. And I'm gonna pop that in. Usually I do season my beans, but because I'm just doing like uh, cheese and beans, I'm not gonna bother. Okay, that should be okay for tomorrow. I'm gonna do half for today and half for tomorrow. Okay, I just got some salt because I didn't I didn't season the potatoes when I put them in. It was just literally 
the oil and yeah and then we've got to add some black pepper like i literally have black pepper <laughs> with everything now for my favorite part butter i love low pack like it's like my favorite butter this and um i've got the one in the yellow packet what it's called that's what it's called it's called country life and yes i add a lot of butter because it's the only way to do it guys i'm trying to do this one-handed so this can get to step in because we don't need this yeah i love low pack and i love country life butter oh guys trust me even though all the butters have gone up lately but oh my gosh i love it i just need a little bit i need to taste a little bit a little taste test before we put the toppings on we gotta have a little taste test guys i'm so sorry if this creeps anyone out me eating with a knife but mm. that is perfect it's a bit for you mm. this is good definitely hitting the spot let me actually put the toppings on now eating it now i see why i put seven guys right, so this is basically the finished product doesn't look like the best of appetizing but you know amazing i don't know if beans on toast is like a brick not beans on toast <laughs> i think beans on toast is a british thing but i don't know if jacket potato cheese and beans is a british thing but it's a classic in the uk and i love it not all the time but when i'm in the mood for it um, I low-key just ate like one potato whilst I was <laughs> whilst I was making this so I took another one that's why it looked like a lot again but mm. tastes gorgeous guys but yeah I think I'm gonna end the vlog here let me end it in some good lighting maybe that's better I think I'm going to end the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm so happy to be back and be doing vlogs with you guys. But yeah, I'll see you soon guys.